could just take me away and nobody would ever know. Miyuki Inaba was right about everything. There was a boundary, so here we are, in 30 kilometers of city. And beyond that, nothing. Wish I could pretend it was all a dream. My own private little adventure with Yuki-chan. Back in my dream, he called himself Tetsuya Ida. We look identical, but that's not my name, so... <sighs> well, it's not just our names. He and I are totally different people. In my dream, her soul was in an android body. That's gotta be the craziest feeling. What would it even be like, not having a body of your own? The way Miyuki- Those dreams weren't from the future like I thought they were. They already happened. It's all in the past. So she was watching me this whole time? On behalf of that shady outfit? Is that why she approached me at all? Yuki-chan. No, wait. I'm the one who approached her. And she has to keep an eye on me? Well, hey, maybe this isn't so bad after all. walls. That means we're in some huge spaceship, right? Why does all of this exist? Why cover up the truth? There is a supercomputer hidden below your town. We call it Universal Control. It has led you to believe you live in Japan, in a certain historical era. Why? Possibly to make your lives easier? Possibly to make you easier to manage. Even I couldn't tell you the real reason. So why are you trying to help us? You still don't know who I am. You and I have met many times in your dreams. Wait. You're not Tetsuya Ida, are you? Thinking this. Shukun, please. We don't have much time. Please, give it some more thought.
Are you Yuki-chan? No. I'm not Yuki-chan. Shukun? You really don't know? We've met in your dreams. Please think a little harder. Well, you're Yuki and Abba, right? Yes. And no. Yuki Inaba is a disguise. You should know what my real name is. Please give it some more thought. The way Yuki Inaba tells it, those dreams weren't from the future like I thought they, they already happened. It's all in the past. Oh, that song from my dream. You don't mean... you're... You finally realized. This is how I got past universal control. I sang on an inconspicuous broadcast with all my heart. Just like I used to. Kisaragi. Yes, it's me. But a different Tomi Kisaragi from the one in your world. I'm not human anymore. Just data on a computer. But that's exactly how I can still help you. Oh no. He's at Sector 3's terminal. Help me, Shukun. If we don't stop him, he'll erase me. What should I do? Inside the outer walls. I hid your sentinel inside. Hey! No, come on! Don't leave me hanging like this! She's gone. What happens if I go there? Can I really make a difference? I can already tell this is gonna be a huge mess. Nope. Nope. A girl has asked for my help. I can't just run away from this. I'll go. And I'll figure out the rest when I get there. Any sudden moves and I shoot. Shinonome Senpai? The door was locked. How did you get in? I broke the lock. With that gun? There was an agent, too. I put him to sleep. Oh, right. You were at the park with him. Are you with the Shady Spy Bureau, too? Yes. So, what do you want with me? I need your Sentinel. My Sentinel? Call it here. That's a thing I can do? I have no idea how. Senpai, I'm sorry. But I've got something I need to do. You want me to shoot you? I have to go stop Ida. Uh. Huh? Sounds like we're on the same side. Past the tunnel? Yeah. That's where the Sentinel's hidden. Apparently. That's some Sentinel. It must weigh hundreds of tons. How does it fly in the air? But what I really don't understand is how you controlled it without any problems. Piloting a Sentinel damages you, like what happened to me. So most people can't operate them. What? You mean piloting a Sentinel did all that stuff to you? You know, it's not too late to turn back. It is too late. Easy, I'm kidding. I'm not gonna give up now. The girl's in trouble. You know where you're going, don't you, Senpai? There are two terminals that have been analyzed so far. Sector 1 and Sector 3. But we can only get into one of them. That'd be the terminal in Sector 3. I'm not really sure I'm following here. Mr. Ida was supposed to take me with him. But he took Takamiya-san instead. Yuki-chan? What's he planning with Yuki-chan? 
He needed biometric ID from one of us. It's the only way he can access the terminal. But now he's put the gate into lockdown. That means a sentinel's the only way to shift in. It's just up ahead. of the spaceship, I guess. It's a spaceship? What are you talking about? Oh, whoa, uh... Okay, so you never found out that part. It's a long story. This doesn't make sense. How could there be a facility like this in a tunnel? I don't know how, but there is. Let's look for the Sentinel. switch. You should have one somewhere on your body. A switch? Where nanomachines were shot into you. That's where code was injected into your system. So that should be where your switch is. <sighs> oh yeah, I got shot. I think she got me right around here? Swipe across it. See if that starts things up. Here goes nothing. So I just swipe it... like this? Looks like we'll fit right through. I guess we're going down. 